There we go. Man, this is really annoying. Whoops. Shouldn't have done that yet. Bomb with the cannon on top. That is a, yeah. Yeah. Alright. So I hope to god OBS, you know, decides to work. Cause it's annoying. This is a sheep part, right? Yep. Now what about over here? Oh, this is a confusing level. Okay, and I'm walking on lava. Don't question it. Just don't. <laughs> it's not worth it, man. This is a long climb. Whoops. Well, later. Later power up, later shell. Yeah, take like that. <sighs> this is a very <laughs> level. And a very confusing one at that. I just screwed myself? Wait, wait, wait. Something about a floor of lava being not lava. Nope, not here. Guess I'm dead. <laughs> um... Huh? I don't get it. I, I don't really feel like that was, uh, justified. <laughs> Maybe... Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know, though. I don't know. On the bright side, I'll probably never find that place again, because this place is ginormous. That was kind of cool.
Whoops. Got some springs. Some giant Goombas and that guy didn't last very long. <laughs> Don't want it. Don't want it. You gotta be careful about these drops, because uh, some of them apparently just kill you. I'm free. Portal ahead. I don't have it. The key. Do I need a key? Do I seriously need a key? Oh man, I don't know if this level has a secret exit, but I'm really hoping it doesn't. <laughs> Honk. This is really long. And I have no idea how I got through it. Okay, it's blue. Static life. Let's get rid of the music. Sharkeners, grasslands. Freaky. <laughs> oh. Hmm. This might get flashy, Mimi. I would probably advise looking away. Belly coin. Static for 18 hours. Yes. I saw something walk in there. Uh... Oh, it's slippery. Oh, did you make this? No, you didn't make it ice physics, okay. That would have been mean. Red is the most important element. Yumi Nikki was pretty cool. I never finished it though. I got lost on something. Very close to what I think was the end. Are they? Well, that explains it. <laughs> Need a key. There's a hippo pig. Mui. Oh, Alright, what was the music? Medotsky's porch. New mini key. Hey. Blue is the most important element that protects us from ghosts. Never eat haunted beats. More like, why not Virus 610, right? Fucking dream. Oh. Green is the greatest of the elements. Without it, we'd have nothing to eat. It's almost as if they're all kind of good in their own way. 
and that without any one of them, we'd be in a whole shit ton of trouble. Hmm. This music changed? I don't remember. No, it didn't. There's this. That's what that says. Lost colors. You mean key. Again, so. Hey, 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 what are you? You're a hoppy dude. <laughs> I'd totally play a Virus Extend character in Speedrunners. <laughs> Psychedelic Eyeball. It's a Psychedelic Eyeball. Another confusing level. Man! Oh, hey. I. Oh, hey. Hmm. Oh. These are slippery and. Oh, man. And moving. -y. Oh, no! Go back down? No, there's nothing. Alright, so just go in, I guess. statue form is that you turn around. <laughs> That's the worst statue form ever. <laughs> I like that crouch animation though. Ooh. Well, shit. Wait. Damn it. Double shit. Come here. No! 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 <laughs> Fuck. Not worth it, man. You're gonna dry out your eyes if you do that. Oh, it's okay. Oh, it was you. It's not okay! Your head's on fire. Sight of Spira. Spira. Bob. Oh, hey, a leak! You're welcome. Take that, wall! No secrets. Lame. All 
And this. I guess. Oh, wait! Hmm. You were mind controlled. <laughs> well, here comes the exposition. Okay. for it. They were forced to be reckoned with. They were known across the universe as the Great Cyclops Grand Rebellion. Unfortunately, the revolution was staged during the Great Green Radish Famine of October. Cyclops is starved to death. Were revived October. And starved hmm. to death again. Eventually, the armless bipedal cycloptic demons were... Wait, armless bipedal cycloptic demons? That's ABCD! Uh, anyway, the armless bipedal cycloptic demons already extinct. Starved to complete death. Very sad. Never again will they graze to the Cyclops hills or enjoy the yearly Cyclops. <laughs> Does it really make you wonder, Laharl? <laughs> will they return to the Cyclops river, into which they were born? Nor will they create their delicious... What's this game over? I didn't see that. So Put it in the middle. Months passed. A crazed psycho known only as the artist, who learned of the Cyclops race from a book he found in an old library found in the ancient monastery up far away into the north, and sought to clone the fatal Cyclops race as brainwashed minions to assist him in conquering the galaxy. Science was the artist's first attempt at creating a cyclopic life form. Due to a lack of resilience in his body, he deteriorated down to a curious floating eyeball shortly following his creation. As technology Good point, passed, Yami. he was equipped with an unidentified flying object that allowed him to ask questions to satisfy his curiosity. Since then, at least we don't have to read it. Of knowledge, but his hardware isn't developed enough for him to speak more than a few broken words at once. He tends to slowly take charge over the other siblings and is currently in search of the Super Leaks across the multiverse. Recently, he upgraded himself and looks terribly out of place, unbugged by it. Pandemona was the second Cyclops created. Attempting to rectify the mistakes made while creating the science, the artist added nails during the creation process to increase resilience. Due to this, she came out extremely unstable and had to be put in a box to limit her power. She's the worst combination of magical, powerful, and incredibly paranoid. Dense as a brick, she will shoot at anything and everything moving in her direction. You seem to have had no trouble with her so far. I would suggest avoiding her in the future, though. She's very power crazed and out for your blood in particular. The artist's next attempt at creating the perfect minion was Garish, the Lord of the Group. Believing he was on the correct path previously, the artist added less nails to Garish, but clearly didn't have enough. There's probably a skip button. But I'm not gonna skip it. Napoleon complex, Garish believes himself to be the greatest of all his siblings. He is fiercely militaristic and declared himself the honorary leader of the Cyclops race. None of us take this seriously, though. Not because he's an incompetent leader, more because he's a kind of just a slimy, objectivist jerk. He recently adopted the name Johnson McCain for himself, weirdo. The artist felt that males may have been a cause of the violence and stupidity prevalent in the previous two siblings, so he decided to spice it up and use a peaceful flower for his next attempt. Due to this, Nevada came out a little weird and poisonous. Lacking legs, he's forced to stand on his head at all times. Although very content with nature and grass and yeah, stuff, he's very shy and jittery. He is downright obsessed with plants and enjoys tending to impressive gardens. He's fiercely You're upside down, what is your dress not to... Uh... He meeting people, especially those he's unfamiliar with. If you would Never mind. He attend the right plant for a lot. He may be chivalrous enough to spare you. For Michi, the artist decided to add a pool noodle. This, of course, <laughs> gave her intense psychic powers. She's a real downer. Of course. Briefly calm, bold, apathetic, occasionally sarcastic, and very extremely super nihilistic. I don't trust her in the slightest. 
I always wear a tinfoil hat when I'm around him, a block for evil mind control powers. His psychic powers allow him to do many creepy, weird things. She's very lazy and emotionless, though, and tends to mostly use them to teach ants to feel pain. I believe she's in league with the government. I would totally watch my back if I were you. She loves to play mind games. And walls and bridges. And double fantasy, she's a John Lennon fan. I was created next. There are speaking <laughs> fire as the cows in my creation. This is really going on. And there's no reason to dwell at me. Kalioka is weird. The callus for her was in Japan. Japan has a universal constant is now canon. Kalioka is a shapeshifter. However, she doesn't have full control over this ability of hers. <laughs> easily become quite hectic and stressed once something goes wrong. And yeah, I agree, Tifu. like any of the other siblings. One eye, no arms and such, but whatever, she shapes out to only has one eye. She's a huge fan of a strange forgotten culture that bewilders and amuses our great historians. She tends to teleport herself between different worlds and dimensions and often takes on a role fitting to the situation with devoted devotion due to her schizophrenia. <laughs> made you two, Dillo and Iris. The callous of you were the exact opposite of the previous callous. A bunch of packing peanuts, a slab of meat, a lead weight, asbestos, and most importantly, a kangaroo. Somewhere along the line, mm. you escaped his brainwashing powers and found a new home with the one of the masters of space. It's now up to you, Demo, to free your other siblings from the evil brainwashing and free me. <laughs> Go forth, young That controller's backwards. Enemies. Be on the lookout for that tricky government that will try to impede your progress. Good luck. <laughs> Everybody's gone. <laughs> Except for me, for some reason. Don't, don't, even. I've got my thumb over the skip button. Well, that was, that was a thing that happened. There we go. Alright, so, let's do the things that I missed. <laughs> Somehow, I don't know what I prefer. Let's go to question marks. A short stroll. This is a nice change of uh, scenery. Yep. Oh, that was a short stroll. Ugh. They're eyeless. Was this level made by Lol Yoshi? <laughs> Ooh. Leviticus 1 6. I don't know Bible shit. Nemesis Ghost. These dudes have green eyes. That submarine's red and bloody! These submarines don't have eyes, though. Hey! Hey! Thanks, Mimi. You're still alive. 
Dr. Shemp made it? Hmm. I don't know that one. Well... How about that? <laughs> What the hell? You're throwing demo heads. Don't, don't do that. That's weird. Oh. Totally worth it. Nope. 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 No. We've entered panic mode. Oh god! <laughs> Don't do it! Oh shh. <laughs> I needed that. Get in there. Alright. Alright, and there's a spooky dog. But it has eyes, so it's only kinda spooky. Honk! She uses her legs, Laurel, to climb. Obviously. Yeah, that was that was neat. Neat little shortcut. Wait, what did that say? Never look back, okay? Alright, I'm looking back. <laughs> that was a pretty interesting level. I liked it. <laughs> Have you ever tried holding a shell while walking with no arms, Laharl? Demo can do it. Magma's Cove. Hey, Death Drew? Cat Planet! Oh, man. There's something I haven't heard of in a long time. Oh, hey! Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Run the run! Well, that's... that's incredibly awkward. And inconvenient. Alright. Hmm. Yeah. It's, uh, it's hard to compare to SMBX. In terms of... <laughs> That's weird, maybe. <isn't> <laughs> Nailed it. He shall flay the burnt offering and cut it into his pieces. Whoops! Weird. I guess they just picked one that- whoops! Man! Come on. That sounded, uh, creepy. Playing is creepy. So is, you know, burnt stuff. There we go. Yeah, sounds like a game face. Notice how she's holding the P-Switch with one leg raised up. And just hopping around on the other one. You ask how she climbs ladders? Without arms? Well, that was rude.
Whoops. No, man. Uh, this level. There's a lot of shit that just comes at me from off screen. Of course, I was going, you know, quickly because I did P switch, but geez, there's a lot of it. Well, would help if I remembered to do the thing. Good. I can hold very particular things with my toes, that's about it. Okay, does that... that doesn't even go all the way down. This one might. Oh. I did not have to use the P-switch before. Hmm. surprised. I know some people who can't, and they like to poke fun at me for picking things up with my toes if I'm too lazy to bend over and pick it up. Hmm. Well, that was kind of not nice. Huh. Nice. I did it! That should be fun. Hi. Goodies lie ahead. I like goodies. But, uh, what about this piece switch here? Nothing. I kind of feel a little let down. Not gonna lie. There's a leak. Does it have a secret exit? It probably does. Yes. This is very green. Hmm. Is that Mimi? Worried about it being unsanitary or something? I suppose it could be back at the. S no, it couldn't be back there. There's no platform. So, where do I want to use this? Do I want to use this somewhere? Or is it just a red herring? Aha! No herrings for me. Well, how could you not figure it out? You... you are... Putting your foot on something, curling your toes, and removing it from low altitude by lifting your foot. One should not get mad at something they don't understand. <laughs> That's dumb. Hey, key. And a leak.
I have no idea. I forgot to check. I'm sorry. Pipe to the outside! Boxing Day. That's Canadian or something. Also, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. Oh, boxing. I get it. You're in a box. Well, copy machine, but... We have to throw skulls at people, eh? Let's do it. That was kind of rude. Alright. That was good. Oh, it powered me up. What? <laughs> well, you travel strangely. What? What on earth are you doing? Um, whoops! I ate my jump. Teleport! Teleport! Demo? <laughs> I guess, uh, I guess... Pandemona just used a save state. We loaded a save state. Lame state. Side door entrance. Get another path into here. Zillanet Village. Incoming millions of text boxes. Also ringing. These vines are going nuts. Nailed it. Oh, well. The village has seen better days. DKC2, Bayou Boogie Midi. Why is it raining? Um, we'll see. Water tends to, you know, evaporate, and uh, as it as the vapor rises into the sky, it forms clouds, and these clouds, you know, get bigger and bigger, and uh, after a while, they come back down in the form of rain, and that's why it's raining. You're welcome. You're harmless. You're just kind of chilling in the house while the rest of the village is smoldering. Clouds are a myth. Incoming link dead emote. In... Five seconds. Damn.
Can't climb this. <laughs> Thanks, Yuniko. Ness? <laughs> Seems fishy. I was trying to account for stream delay. <laughs> Oh, hey. Well. The sound of jumping out of a boot is a BB... I want to enter this house. So only parts of the roof are uh, walk onable. Sup, fire under the bridge. Oh, right, you can't swim in a boot. I forgot. Oh, hey. E. I don't even remember where we left off with the letters. And see Nirvana. I got two out of two. One out of one. Two out of two. Two out of two. One out of one. There's a lot of. Mo oh no, I missed one. And oh fuck. Oh god damn it. There's another one there. Well. <laughs> and I missed one in Static Life. And Shoe Zone 2, I don't even think I've seen that one. Is there any reason to doing this? Whoops! Bad time to scratch a chin. Oh, I see. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, well... No! Uh, 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 uh. I'm stuck in limbo. Wait, nope, uh, there we go. Chen? Vergalon. <laughs> Can't escape red and white Nikos. Hmm. <laughs> oh, hey, a dog. <laughs> when did that happen? T. Huh. That, yeah, that does appear to be Chen. In a Karibo shoe. A little Triforce. Foltos. Until Cannon, you're here. Oh, hey. Dirks. Might as well get geared up, right? Oops. The music reach your heart. What is this music again? Right. DKC2. Hmm. 
Mm. Hmm. What are you? Dunno. Hmm. <laughs> Whoops. I'm pretty sure that's Jen. Oh, hey. No! Well, now we'll never know. Oh, it was a power-up. Thought it was something I could talk to. Damn! Alright, so... I've got work to do. I've missed a lot of uh, leaks, and unfortunately one in a level I was hoping not to have to play again. Oh, hey! I kneeled twice. In fact, this character quite literal literally kneels. Alright, so something about a shoe. And static. Hmm. I don't remember a shoe level at all. Is that it? Oh, I was just here. Static? Hmm. Static. No. Well, <laughs> I guess we're doing this level first. I have to find a key somewhere in the universe. Yeah, like, it's- it's an interesting level, it's just really fucking long, really fucking confusing, and... there's two leaks. Which is about the last thing that I think anybody who plays this level was hoping to find out. Yeah, like, the length is only an issue because it's so confusing. Like, I, it would be fine to have a big old level that is of reasonable difficulty as it is. It's just... Well, aside from that one part where I just dropped down and then was forced to die, I didn't really think that was cool at all. 
Um, but, uh, yeah, it's just, like, I, it, I don't know where the hell I am 99% of the time. And on top of that, I have to find a key somewhere in this gigantic stage. That's gonna be fun. Whoops. Who needs that power up? Um, like, I didn't check for invisible blocks with vines or anything, because I recalled reading a hint in that, uh, that unlockable place that said something about, um, a floor of lava not actually being real or something. And I thought that's what it was talking about, but I was wrong. So I just walked onto it and... Wait, I should not do that. Oh, I think I got rid of them all already. Damn! So yeah, like, it's entirely possible that there is a way out, but, uh... There might not be. And in any case, I wouldn't know, because I don't even know how to get back there. Oh, I think this is it, actually. That was my chance to find out. Nope. I lied. This is something else entirely. Uh, I don't mind the music here. But... Then I also... Sometimes listen to that sort of music, so... <laughs> There's that. Whoop! Oh, I did not mean to double down there. That was unfortunate. Well, hopefully that wasn't a thing that matters, because uh, it's gone forever. Hey, mean kid, how you doing? Hmm. And this is the exit, isn't it? Nope, I lied. <laughs> hmm. Can I do this? Is this possible? Yeah! <laughs> Hmm. 